And there's that damn submarine again. Hello, hello, hello! Tuna here coming in to get a Sichuan. Ooh, that's something loud. To bring you another video of War on the Sea. Oh man, I got that out in one go. Ooh, and I'm running out of breath halfway through. But yes, today, and more than likely tomorrow, it's going to be War on the Sea because it's just so easy. I jump on, I hit the record button, sit for 30 minutes, a little bit more maybe, and send. Let's see, maybe the occasional, like last video. Edit here and there, it's small and just really easy as compared to you boat where I have to sit down for I want to do everything correctly and not be, uh, what was I doing again type of phase. I gotta sit down for two to three hours. <laughs> Maybe one and a half hours depending on a patrol and all that other fun snafu we could call it. But. I do enjoy it. So, you know, no harm, no foul. Anywho, yeah, that'll be coming back on the weekends. And uh, I'm recently, I'm, I'm still keeping track with, um, if you remember the Pacific Storm uh, live stream I did a long time ago when it, after, you know, freaking broke. Uh, that will be done again, I'm telling you this right now. I will be doing another Pacific Storm again. Probably not for a long time, but it will be done again. Because I just got done reading something from Patreon from WWJD. They're the people who created Pacific Fury. Oh my god, <laughs> it's amazing. They finally, f well I say it once they finish, but they're almost done. With the Fabuki and the Fletcher um, models. Uh, they got the wakes and everything all new. Uh, they just got done with the hit boxes and the hit points, I believe, of the Mo new Mogami um, model. And the weather looks not only much better, I just got done looking at it and actually just got done sending messages to the creator of probably the single greatest addition this mod will add waves and I'm not talking about anyway I mean waves that will jump up and you know push the ships up and down like in war on the sea oh I cannot wait now that's still in an early progress and we only saw a little snippet and it just had the normal thing with the with the superimposed I guess wave on top of it but that's gonna obviously take some work but oh my god God, I'm so I'm so glad I'm supporting this. I might put their, if it gets requested, I might put the Patreon link down below <coughs> for uh, Pacific Fury. And yeah, I'm I've been supporting it since. Oh, let's see, how long ago have I been? How long have I been supporting this thing? Uh, come on, at least Patreon does not like to be running, ah, I just got a message from a total day, but I've been Patreon for, it won't tell me, huh, oh, there we go, it's about, uh, Well, you know what, whatever, fuck it, I'm not gonna, I'm, yeah, I'm just not gonna freaking worry about that, I guess, uh, at least a year, a year, at least, yeah, at the least, so, you know, support stuff you like, if you find a creator you like, support them, at least, give them something, anywho. <clears throat> we got enough enough about uh other things. We got a uh, war. War to fight. And aircraft to fly. We know there's another uh we know there's a cruiser force down here next to these uh KI forty three. We know about this submarine. Um Do you even have the range if I throw the depth charges on? 
You do. Good luck, buddy. I know he has to go this way, so. Where in the hell is he going? Well, there's the cruisers, and we got them spotted. Okay, the 800 kilograms. I think that's all we're going to need for the cruiser. Uh, you'll be done in 2.3. I'm going to obviously wait. Uh, I'm going to move you guys down this way, although you're probably not going to have the range because I want them to cover the bombers at minimum. Okay, well, you can go cover the bombers. You can RTB, and then New Georgia can launch the rest of these. Oh, there's only four. Oh, yeah, because they took a decent amount of bomb hits. Uh, you should be able to deal with, you four should be able to deal with a destroyer. Such a small destroyer compared to, say, like, the, uh, Gleaves. Move you out this way. And this is why we did this. Tactical. And I'm going to have you guys do the low altitude hello bombing. Actually, everyone's going low altitude hello bombing. I don't know why I call it hello bombing. It really isn't. It's just, you know, dropping it right on them. Oh, because they are right there. Okay. Well, you guys go take the fire. These things are really maneuverable, evidently. One, two, three, four. Wait, that's the cruiser. We don't want the cruiser, we want the destroyer. Wow, these things turn. Ooh, he came flying around the corner. Have fun. <coughs> Oh, that's almost perfect right there. Well, you are in a horrible... That looks like it'd be a little bit painful. Your rear guns are just fine. I'm amazed all those bombs worked. Uh, you guys need to be flying as fast as you can. See if you can get any lower. Okay, well. Yeah, I kind of figured that destroyer is dead. Makes life a little bit easier, you could say. <clears throat> well, these guys are coming in nice and fast, but remember, I want them all going at their own best angle now because of. We just need them to hit. Your internal bomb bay looks pretty darn good. Now I expect. Oh. I'm gonna go with four. I'm gonna go with four going down. Kind of bugs me that those guns all shoot at the same time. I don't know why, but I guess a little pet peeve. Taking control over you. And this is why I said I expect to lose two. He got hit by a flak round, so... But he got the bombs off. Ooh, that was a... Mine was a dud. A little unfortunate. Oh, that's another one down. You 
look like you're going to miss. Sort of. Let's take a real quick look see. There we go, that looks good. Should be near the front. Yep. Uh, no, we need you to stay there. Try to get as many hits on the front of the ship as possible. Okay, I wonder if that will do it. Yep, that would do it. That was a successful strike, I would say. At least I would say. I, I don't know, four planes for a destroyer and a cruiser? Let's take a look at what was dead from this formation. The enemy just lost Brooklyn herself. Ouch. Bagley herself and the Fletcher. All lead class ships. Mmm, tuna. Okay, well, RTB, RTB, and you go deal with these fighters, because I know they're going to be annoying later, so. A single f rogue fighter. Okay, well, he's going to be going after you. I know this because of how the AI works. And as such, we do this. Oh, it's one. Well, that was ridiculously easy. I mean, it was only one fighter, but still. That one must have died from, um... <coughs> Excuse me. The, uh, Emily. Or the... Mavis. Whatever, whatever, whichever one it was. Don't know, don't care. Float plane killed him. Simple as that. Crest spot. Okay, a float plane. We'll deal with that in a second. Okay. Spotty weather. Weather. The weather. It'll be a little bit difficult finding this submarine. Start heading down, though. No need to dive that. I mean, it is a dive bomber. This way. I would say. 
Huh. Well, he would have dove by now because it's an American submarine and they have radar. A little unfortunate. Wait a few seconds here. I don't think we found anything just quite yet. Wait a little bit longer. I'd like to sink this submarine because he's been kind of annoying lately. If I wanted to be a cheap person, I could just unload and reload and then see. like hunting a submarine in the freaking rain. RTP. Uh, what am I going to do about you? They look like they were part of the cruiser. Looks like. But just because it looks like they were part of the cruiser doesn't mean Jack Diddley. I did not mean to launch them all. Well, that's a lot of... Yeah, they were all from the uh, cruiser. Careful about the tail gunner. We all know how tail gunners work. Oh, that works. <clears throat> I will gladly take all of them uh, shot down. Something wrong is, sure, they're going to crash anyways, but it's still, you never know. They could have flown somewhere else somehow. Okay, that one I'm going to ignore. I-17, I'm going to move this way <laughs> as I hiccup. I would like to have more points, but not much I can do at this point in time. And you're just sitting there, aren't you? For whatever reason. Unfortunately, it looks like my idea of the... Uh, ASW patrols don't work too freaking well. A little unfortunate, but... Okay, we lost some troops during the fighting. Go ahead down this way. Just for the hell of it, why not? Empty seas, I'll tell you that much. Now it's also nighttime. I suppose it's, I read something. Uh, there was something being changed to a different side of the island. It was. Uh, oh, which one was it? One moment, por favor. It was, uh, Santa is a. Operations available. Okay. Uh. Ah, this one. This one's gonna be over here. Okay. That's fine by me. I'm not using it, so. And probably never will. <coughs> okay, well, you made it to base. You are the supply, so. So we're gonna be going here. <clears throat> Manage cargo. Okay, we're gonna do supplies. Thank you. 
The fact that you can't carry hundreds are kind of annoying. I have to fuck around with this one, aren't I? Well, let's see. Eh, my idea wasn't gonna work, evidently, with this fleet. I need to... It'll be where ah, Chitose came back. Let's say where those command points come from, but they're from Chitose, and this will be worth it. So we're going to keep one of these, but we're going to release one as well. <coughs> Confirmed. Now we're going to do a Camera Ball. Thank you. New C, one of the. Uh, no, not AOs. Merchant ships. Uh, nope, uh, that's for U.S. or U.S. I don't think any. No, it's gonna be one of the Kamigawas. Done. So it drops now to forty-seven, unfortunately. But oh, I need to do this. Uh, merge. Okay, swap, swap. That. And now we manage cargo. It's gonna be you are going to carry the supplies. You will carry the fuel. Uh, you don't have any fuel, but I'm gonna. And so I'm actually gonna. Given that we're gonna have to wait a week, I am gonna drop this guy as well. I am confirming that, so that way in three days we get more points. Instead of we have to wait another seven, about maybe five to six more days. I manage cargo again. I only need a hundred of it. Engineering, a hundred. And uh, I'll bring a few troops along just for a little bit of security. And you're going to go to Viva La Vida. I know it's uh, not that one. Oops, that would have been very bad if I didn't figure that one out. To uh, Villa La Villa. Island the Island. Combat convoys are going to sit up there for a while. I don't know what I'm going to do with Hosho's group. Or correction, Zuiho's group. I really wish I could replace the planes a lot easier. Come back down here into the battle zone a little bit more. Maybe we can catch some more shit. Oi! You got a job to do. Do it. There you go. Carrier. Ooh, we found a submarine. Let's make sure we're in the correct column formation. Okay, we are. Uh, two, okay, six tornadoes in the lead. Okay, I think we should be good. Uh, do we have, we do have Sendai Free for launching aircraft, but we should be fine. Our destroyers should be able to take care of them. Sendai has, depth charge. yeah, we have, yeah, we haven't even, I don't think we even used any depth charges for Carrier Force 1. Well, you're going to do sonar, and you're going to do sonar. You're also going to do radar, just in case somehow there's some form of aircraft. And you are going to... I like how this ship looks, not going to lie. I like how Zuiho looks. I like how many of the Japanese carriers look, except for the uh, Kagi and Kaga. They, I actually don't like how they look. At least, their ship forms. There she is. I can see. As I thought I saw. Yeah, I was right. Okay, so it was over here. Well, at that range, that's gonna be. Go to active sonar. I actually can't see these. Oh, she's right there. I. Yeah, Q 
heal that ship around. And I think I'll have you actually slow the fudge down. Ten knots, yeah. Because those torpedoes are expecting you to continue flying fast. Rudder midships. Okay, so it looks like they're heading for Zuiho. Tone you're going to break and at maximum speed. Teretsuki, you're just going to keep going straight and at maximum speed. Sendai, also going to break, but you're going to go this way. Slow speed. Actually, I'm just going to have you stop and just we're gonna start going backwards. Teretsuki, yeah, you just keep going straight. Akatsuki, uh, Zuiho, actually, no. Zuiho, you're going to go hard left. Akatsuki, you're going to go here. Okay. Actually, yeah, slow down to 10 knots as well. Zuiho, you're turning, right? I'm going to let the AI do the attack here. Teretsuki is easily going to outspeed it. Okay, Zuiho. I'm going to continue to have you turn until I say so. Okay. Now you're good. So I'm not sure what you're doing. So this is either a... I can't tell. I don't know what the hell you're doing as a tambor class. Okay, uh, slow down 10 knots, please. Akatsuki, I'm going to command you to just stop completely. I need you to slow down. Zuiho, please tell me you're not going to... Okay, good. Uh, okay, Suki, do not do auto avoidance. Do not do auto avoidance. And neither do you, Zuiho. You just maintain your orders. Ping, ping, ping. Okay, Zuiho, you're good. Okay, increase this 10 knots. Ping, ping. Should be able to just nice and slowly position myself right above the American submarine. Akatsuki will, with her ping, will be able to keep Tambor spotted. While Yagumo here comes along on top. Uh, depth charges. I'm gonna have you do a full. We'll do a three volley with mm, your traditional five second delay. Use the submarine here to help. Now, if a destroyer gets into this position and you're in a World War II submarine, you're kind of barred here. Okay, now let's increase speed to get our uh, depth charge attack a going. Uh, 18 knots will do. Maximum speed and actually drop it along the length. So now. Eight knots. We're on the right side. That one got her. That one also got her. Yeah, she should be sinking without a problem. Yep. 
There goes the emergency blow. Oh, stop if you would please. Oh, stop and we will wait for her to surface. Actually, it looks like she can't go up. Nope. Okay, well first off, I don't want to keep losing my fucking eardrums. Yeah, she's too much damage. She cannot come up. Okay, you know what? You go back to pinging. Oh yeah, she's so dead. Uh, what is the maximum dive depth here? Terribly sorry about this pinging. I really am. Tambor, 91 meters. That works. <whistles> How long is it going to take for you to die, motherfucker? Die! There we go. Damn. It took forever to sink. Who were you? Trout. I think I still hear the pinging in my eardrums. Pretty loud as hell. Okay, looks like, where is the American Navy? I don't like this. Found something. There we go. Three merchants, a light cruiser, a destroyer, and an escort. Well, goddamn time we found something. Jeez. Do I have anything in range of the, well, lay. The Gankos do, but they, uh. I don't think. Hmm. Hmm. Well, let's see if these submarines can get into a shooting position. Oh, yeah, with the merchants for sure. Careful not to get too spotted. Okay, we went right there. Almost screwed that up. A little bit closer. The hell did they just go? Right there, a little too close for comfort in the moment. We should be set up good to go next time. This is Two Toss, and thank you for joining me on this Let's Play of War on the Sea. Stay safe, and as always, have an awesome, awesome day.